Good evening and welcome to Travel Talk with Lori. And Bill. And Bill. Yep. And Bill. Tonight we're going to talk about all the fun stuff we're going to do next year. And we're going to start off by talking about our customer appreciation night. But first we want to thank our Ross. Rocky Mount Toyota, our sponsor. Because they are so good to sponsor us and they definitely are the best place in our mind to buy a vehicle. Yes they are. Whether new or pre-owned. Yep. They are definitely the place. And for service. Yes. They have an excellent service department too. So if you need any type of service on your vehicle and are wondering who to go see, Rocky Mount Toyota would be the one to pick up the phone and call. Yes, they will be. I think so. All right. So we've got a flyer that we're going to put up that shows about our customer appreciation night and we're going to talk about it because it's coming up Thursday night, September 23rd from 530 to 830. It's kind of like a floating event. We're going to be out at the Gateway Technology Center here at Wesleyan College, and we'd like to welcome all of you to come out and meet at my supplier, Eric Kelly from Globus Family of Brands, is going to be here, and we're going to be talking about certain travel destinations for next year in little snippets, but we're just going to be walking around talking, getting to know travel, getting to know each other, and um, we're going to be eating some really great um, hors d'oeuvres yes. from Prime Smokehouse. So I'm inviting everybody to come out. That is this Thursday night from 5.30 to 8.30, September 23rd. There's also going to be um, swag bags with all kinds of goodies, and we're going to have all kinds of free giveaways for you to register for. So come out and join in all, all the fun. So next we want to start talking about our groups we have planned for next year from Coffee Mug Travel. The first one we are going to do is our Valentine's Getaway number two. We did yes. the first one in 2019. And everybody knows we've not been able to get the second one in for 2020 or 2021. But come February of 2022, we will be selling out of Charleston, South Carolina on the Carnival Sunshine for our second annual Valentine's Cruise Getaway. It's a very, very good cruise. It's it's a short cruise, but it's it's nice. It's a nice, comfortable ship, and we've sailed on the Sunshine what four or five times now. Six or seven. So, yeah, yeah, something like that. But yes, and of course we're going to be leaving on Thursday, so we're going to. It's pretty much going to be a weekend cruise. Sail out on Thursday, be gone Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and come back into port on Monday, which actually will be Valentine's morning when you come back in. But I'm thinking Sunday night is going to be a great night to celebrate Valentine's Day yes. at sea. Yep. Then next, we're going to throw up a picture of the tulips we're going to be seeing in Amsterdam. Because we are going to Amsterdam with the Rocky Mount Chamber in March, March 31st through April the 7th, 2022. And we are going to be seeing all these tulips in Amsterdam and outside of Amsterdam and all the windmills and chocolate and Gouda cheese and all kind of fun. So if you'd like to join us for this, come out Thursday night and we can get you signed up to be on the, the uh, Tulip Time River Cruise with the Chamber of Rocky Mount and see all these nice tulips. And every time I see these colors, I just want to be there and see them. Yes. So that's going to be a great event. Now next we're going to talk about our Spring Fling Cruise. Because we are going to be selling out on the Carnival Magic on May the 26th through May the 30th out of Norfolk. And we're going to Bermuda. Which is, what, three, three and a half hour drive from here? Which is... To, to Norfolk, oh yes. Which I, isn't bad at all. Yeah, yeah, and we're going to sell out on the Carnival Magic. So that's going to be a great cruise because it is a short four day there again. We're leaving, we're leaving on the 26th, we're coming back on the 30th, but we're going to Bermuda. And if I'm not mistaken, is that not an overnight? In Bermuda? Yes. I think so. I, I think, think it's so. an overnight. But we're going to have a lot of fun going to Bermuda. Yes. On the Carnival Magic. Then the next one we've got coming up is going to be our Hawaii Islands Cruise with Norwegian Cruise Line. And that one is going to be in September the 17th through the 24th of 2022. And that one's going to be a great one. We've got a nice group going with us on that one. We still have more room in our group. But we're gonna. That's gonna be a great time. There's Fly, always room for more. Flying into Honolulu <laughs> and boarding that cruise ship is gonna be awesome. Yes, yes. Hawaii is absolutely gorgeous. If you haven't been there, you have to try it. Now, if you've been thinking about, you know, we're not giving you any prices on these groups. What you, you can find out the prices one of two ways. You can come Thursday night, and there's gonna be a price list. It's gonna give you the basic prices. 
or you can give me a call and the phone number is on the screen 252-379-1581 I'll be glad to talk with you about prices or I'll be glad to meet with you in a coffee shop and we can talk about all kinds of travel and talk about the prices I have for my groups and these are all groups that we will be on with our clients so yeah we will be escorting all these groups as well as our Irish discovery that's coming off in October we're going to be going into Dublin and flying back out of Dublin so it's Dublin to Dublin we're actually going to be doing all of Ireland and then part of we're going to be with the whole, whole Northern Ireland so we got a map here and this shows that we're doing all these spots I can't believe we're going to be able to do everywhere I want to go in Ireland and then Northern Ireland we're going to Belfast and we're going to see where the Titanic was made built built made <laughs> built <laughs> okay Mr. Navy guy built not me okay yes but I'm so excited about all the destinations we're going into in Ireland because we're going to pretty much do pretty much anywhere you want to go yep so this is gonna be a fun trip to Ireland and we overnight Halloween night yes in we're, gonna, we're gonna stay an extra night the 31st Halloween night because I have heard that Halloween night in Dublin is better than St. Patty's Day so we're gonna stay and see so technically most of my group will not be flying home until November the 1st yep. of 2022. So this is going to be a great tour. Now we have another one we're getting ready to put a map up for, and that's going to be our Paris. Paris, Normandy, and the Loire Valley. And this one is a great, great trip. But I think it's so great because of one of the stops you have on it. Not only Normandy, but um, Mont St. Michael. Yes. When you, because that, that, is, that is just a fantastic, it's a monastery that you get to go in. It almost looks like a castle. But when I saw it, I'm like, I, I should be on this trip. Now, this is one we will not be escorting at this time. But we have a great group going on this trip, and they would love to have some more people join their group. Um, so if you're interested in going to Paris next year, this is a great trip. Yes, it is. It is definitely a great trip, and it is going to be from um, July 9th through the 16th, 2022. So it's going to be a great, tri great trip over to Paris and being able to go to Normandy and to all these other stops and then come back into Paris. Yes, indeed. Okay. So we've talked about those. We've talked about the Norwegian trip. We might as well go ahead and talk about our Thanksgiving cruise on the Carnival Mardi Gras, which we were just on. Four, four weeks, weeks ago. Four weeks ago, okay. <laughs> four weeks ago today, we got off to Mardi Gras, okay. I have to keep thinking because it's getting further and further in the, in the, in the past. Four weeks ago today, we actually got off, August yeah. 21st. So we are going back on November the 26th through December the 3rd, 2022. We're actually going to take a family cruise on this ship sooner than that. We're going to be on it July 30th of 2022. But this is, this is the next group we're going to have on there. And we are leaving the weekend after Thanksgiving. So Thanksgiving's on Thursday. We're leaving on Saturday. And we're sailing until December 3rd. And this is going to be a great cruise. Yep. And this is a great ship. So we'd love to have everybody that would like to join us. Come and join our group. Because we're going to have a fantastic time. Now the only other one we haven't talked about is our Panama Canal on Norwegian. And we're going to be doing it in December the 21st of 2022 through January the 2nd of 2023 and we are going through the whole entire Panama Canal we are going down to Aruba, Bonaire and Curacao we are also going to do a couple places in Colombia yep so this is a great great cruise for the end of the year and we are yes we're going to be selling over Christmas yes and New Year's because we're not coming back into Miami until January the 2nd and somebody else will be doing the cooking and the cleaning up afterwards. So yep. can't be better. Yeah, we've had to we've had to put our families on notice that we're not going to be around there here at Christmas. So, so don't come to our house to get a meal because we won't be there. No, nope, we'll be on that Norwegian ship having a good time. And he's right, having somebody wait on us. So these are all great groups we have planned. We also do all kinds of travel. If you want to go to Portland, Oregon. We're definitely the people to help you get there. We've been to Portland a few times on a truck. Yep. Just a few. Just a few. Um, we can point out a few places you might want to go if you're in Oregon. The Dells. Yep. If you want to go to Northern California, that's another place we've been quite a few times. Weed. <laughs> Weed, California. California. Yep. We can, we can point you in the right direction, okay? 
Um, if you want to go to Maine or Massachusetts, we're definitely the people to talk with. We have sort of got a group starting to plan to do um, fall foliage up in New England for 2022. But all that stuff's not finalized yet, but we'll be on that one. And we're thinking about riding Amtrak out of Rocky Mount up to Boston and then getting on this tour. So we have a lot of things we've got planned going on, a lot of great activities going on. And we're, like I said, we're willing to meet and talk about travel anytime. You want to go to Las Vegas? I bet you I can beat some of the prices on the internet. You yep. go to Vegas, yep. okay? I bet I can, okay? All then, inclusive down in, down the Caribbean? We have some great prices for down the Caribbean. We certainly do. Or to Mexico. Yes. Because I think one of my favorite areas to send people to is Cancun, Riviera Mar. Of course, you know I'm in love with the Azul Resorts. Yes. So, yes, she is. Especially they swim up suites. Yes. You know, and they got, they got a chase lounge that's actually in the water at your swim up. Yeah, and eventually I'm going to be there laying, reading my books. Eventually. Eventually that's going to be on my, my, my list. I know you thought you are right. Me laying around reading books not doing anything else. Yes. Okay, we have a few videos we're going to see for a commercial break. We're going to let you see those. And then we're going to come back and talk about some more travel and talk about our customer appreciation night again. So stay tuned. We'll be right back after these, this short commercial break with these videos. On a blue sky, sunny day Watch all the worries of the world just sail away An ocean, keep your heart wide open I'm too busy feeling this free
when you think about how amazing that ship was. Yes, it was. And all the different areas that were to explore on that ship. And all the amazing finds that we, you know, checked out for the first time. Oh, like yeah. uh, Shaq's Big Chicken on board there. That was that was amazing. It and was amazing. It was amazing chicken. It was. And how much bigger, um, like, the pizza place was. It was huge compared to some of the other ships that we've been on. And the Italian sandwiches that we were able to get. Oh, yeah. Uh, don't get me started because we'll just talk about food the rest of the we, night. We, we'll chill out to it. My mind's going gelato, <laughs> strawberry, frozen, frozen yogurt. yogurt. Yes, yes. I start thinking about it and, and emeralds with the shrimp and grits. I, yes. start th I start thinking about food. He's right. We'll be talking about food the rest of the night. Yes, we will be. So um, maybe we should move right along and talk about um, Norwegian Cruise Line. Yes. Now, we're going to be on the Pride of America. She does not have a casino. Yes. No casino on the Pride of America. So that means there's a lot more open space on board there because she never gets out into international waters because she's pretty much hugging the Hawaiian coastline. So yes. she never gets out into international waters. So no casino. But, of course, they still have my favorite areas, the shops. Yes. Because they have the shops and the restaurants. Okay? Mm -hmm. Restaurants. Okay. My two favorites. See, I've circled right back around the food. You notice that, right? Yep. 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 They also have really good specialty coffee on board Norwegian too. Of course, they have fantastic specialty coffee on on Carnival. So now we've come full circle right back round to food. Mm-hmm. I thought we'd talk a little bit about how we meet our clients in coffee shops. Yep. Come meet us. We'll buy you a cup of coffee. We'll talk about where you want to travel to. Um, lately, I've, I've had the the pleasure of researching somebody's trip to Seattle. Yes. And I actually found out what it is you don't want to stay in Seattle. So that was that was a good find for me to know that there are areas you don't want to go because you, you cannot go out after dark. Mm -hmm. you know? Yes. But if you stay downtown Seattle, you're pretty safe. Right there close to everything. Pike Street Market. The Space Needle. Space Needle. Yep. Yep. And the, and the ferry systems, if you want to take a ferry ride, they, they go almost everywhere in Washington State. They do. They do practically, <laughs> okay. Of course, not out to Leavenworth. No, no. Where I'd like to go. And you can ride Amtrak from Seattle right out. It's like an hour and 15 minutes. Little Bavarian village up yes, there. Yes, yes, yes. We're, we're going to be getting a group together to go there one day. Yes. Because I definitely want to go. You know, uh, that definitely is a place I want to visit. I kind of discovered that during COVID, and I'd really love to go there. Yes. Yep. But of course, I'd like to go during Christmas because they have Christmas markets just like they do in Germany. Germany. Yes. They do. They have Christmas markets. So, like, I want to go then. I want to go in the spring of the year. There's several times a year I'd like to go there. So, but we're we're available to talk about anywhere you want to go, and it's always interesting to find out where my clients do want to go. Mm -hmm. You know, I've talked to lately a lady that wants to go to Jamaica, and then I've talked to a group that wants to go to Rome. So it's always interesting where people want to go, you know. And every once in a while you talk to somebody that wants to go to Africa. Yep. So, you know, we do all those kind of trip planning. We also plan if you want to go to Tennessee, the North Carolina mountains, the North Carolina coastline, or down to Myrtle Beach. If you can dream it, we can make it a reality. We certainly can. You know, we've had people talking about going to New York City. Yep. Again, for Christmas, seeing the Christmas lights and, and everything you can see around Central Park and all the shopping. Who wouldn't want to go shopping in New York City at Christmas time? Not me. You know, you could just hop right on Amtrak <laughs> right here in Rocky Mountain and go right on into to New York City. I am not a shopping person. <laughs> I, I tolerate it enough to go with my wife, but if she has a friend that wants to go with her, I will stay home instead of going shopping. shopping. <laughs> hey, that might be a good idea. I could plan that that girl's shopping trip in New York City for Christmas. And I'll stay home with my babies. Yeah, you can stay home with her doggies. Yep, you sure can. Sure can. So, let's talk a little bit more about what we're going to be doing on Thursday night for our customer appreciation night. Sounds good. Okay. Not only are we going to be enjoying really good good food that's going to be catered, but we're also going to be talking with Eric Kelly from Globus Family of Brands about all kinds of travel. He'll be talking about the Tulip Time Cruise. He'll be talking about um, Irish Discovery. He'll be talking about Paris. He's and also any other 
things that you might want to walk up and talk to right. him he's about. also going to he also available to talk about the national park tours that they do yeah because they do some fantastic national park tours like yellowstone mount rushmore yellowstone at christmas time well that's actually the first of the year yeah yellowstone in the winter time yeah that's what i want to do i can see me there in wyoming i can outside of jackson hall in that sleigh she gets right. cold here <laughs> That's okay. I think I can put enough clothes on. Okay. I think it'll be a fantastic trip. Okay. See, you can't mention anywhere to go traveling that Lori doesn't want to go. Okay. That I'm not going to put on my bucket list. But we're going to be having all kinds of fun, networking with each other, talking about travel, talking about each other's businesses, and also there will be prizes to register for. And who knows what's going to be available. Okay. So if you're thinking about maybe joining one of these trips, Thursday nights will be a time to come out and talk with us because we're going to have lots of goodies given away and then there's swag bags. I'll grab all kinds of goodies from local small businesses as well as from us inside that little goodie bag. Yes. So that's going to be, a, it's going to be great. And I'm excited because I've invited all my prior customers. And if you're thinking about being one of our clients, please come out, get to know us because we'll be here. We won't be having coffee Thursday night, though. But we are going to have hot apple cider. Yes. And it is going to be a little bit cooler Thursday. That's good. We're also going to have another very special guest, Dr. Gina Node from out at Wesleyan College from the Entrepreneur Department. She is going to be there. So if you've ever wanted to meet her, come on out and meet her because she'll be there. And she is one special lady. And she'll even talk travel with you. Because I happen to know she has a very special trip planned for Greece next year. And that is another topic Eric's going to be talking with us about is Greece. Because they have a fantastic Greece. Yes, they do. Greece tours. So he'll be talking about Greece too. And Greece is a gorgeous place. We know from experience we've been there. So. Yes, we have been. Yep, that was one of the last really big trips we took before COVID hit. Yeah. That was one we kept thinking about, like, remember when we were in the Mediterranean? Yeah. Remember when we were sitting there in Naples having pizza? Yeah. And drinking espresso at that, at that nice little pizza that place? That was in Sorrento. No, that was in Naples. Oh, okay. We yeah, had, yeah, yeah. We, 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 did, we had coffee. We had Americanos in Sorrento. That's right. That's right. I'm we wrong. Did. We did. Yep. We See, did. on TV, I admitted I was wrong. Now, we also had fantastic pasta in Florence. Yes. With gelato. Yes. Oh, and that was the best gelato I've ever had. Yes. Was when we had it in Real Florence, Italian Italy. gelato. Yeah, Florence, Italy. Okay. So, you know, it, it's not hard to get us talking about travel. You know, sometimes I think we overwhelm our clients when we start talking about everywhere we've been, where we want to go, what we know. But if you have somewhere you want to travel to and you want some information about it, we are the people to contact Lori and Bill with Coffee Mug Travel because we pretty much know. Especially the lower 48, we know very well. We've probably been on every major highway and some not so major yeah we, 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 roads. We, we've been places especially <laughs> in Pennsylvania we've been some places okay? yes we have Indiana we've been some places so now we also have associates who we're going to start bringing on to introduce to everybody they'll be here Thursday night because you may know one of these wonderful people and you'll get to meet them if you come out on Thursday night you'll get to meet our three associates we've got now We've got one that cannot be here because she'll be traveling. So we've got three that'll be here. And so come on out, meet us, talk with us about travel, have a good time Thursday night, and decide, yes, these are the people I want to book travel with. Yeah. If you don't want to do it with us, we have other people that you can talk we, to. We have and associates, and, yeah. and they will be more than willing to talk with you and want to, want to book you because we're just one big happy family here at Coffee Mug Travel. Yes, we are. So once again, we want to thank our sponsor, Rocky Mount Toyota because they are such wonderful people to sponsor us and they do travel with us by the way so we, we have to bring Miss Amanda back on to talk about her Vegas trip sometime but we just want to thank them again tonight before we sign off yes and um, we're looking forward to seeing you all Thursday night September the 23rd 5 30 to 30 we'll be right here at the Gateway Technology Center and having a good time talking travel Looking forward to seeing y'all. Next week's show, you'll get to see my special guest in the studio, Mr. Eric Kelly from Globus Family of Brands. And we'll be talking travel. So y'all have a great week. We'll see you Thursday night, and we'll see you next week for Travel Talk with Lori. And Bill. And Bill. Of course, next week it'll be Lori and Eric. Yeah.
because we won't be here. Lori will be interviewing here. See y'all next week. Have a good week. <laughs>